Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So, first of all, you've never seen me with a lip color anything close to this. But today I'm, I have it on because I'm going to show it and I just want to try the formula out for you guys before I started talking about the stuff. So, I did, I mean it's an okay online purchase. It's not like huge, it's not like super tiny. But I have been waiting for one of these packages for three weeks in order to show you everything else. So I'm going to go on with that first because in case the video is too long because I'm going to ramble about this stuff for too long, then I'll just do that in part two. But I really want to do this stuff first. So, first of all, the cutest packaging I've ever gotten in a, um, in a mail box. Like, cutest packaging. Okay, so this is what it looks like. If you are familiar with the brand, then you know. It's a little bit messed up because I already went into it, so I tried to tape it back up for you guys. But... If you follow them on Instagram and you've ordered them, ordered from them before, then you know what this brand is. This is Lime Crime Makeup. So I'm wearing one of the lipsticks, but I'll show you that once I get to the lipstick portion. Get out all this stuff. Okay, I'm so excited. I'll show the nail polishes first, I guess. I got, I think, like six things. I'm not sure. So I got two Lime Crime nail polishes. Cutest packaging ever. Wing 2C lipsticks, if you've never seen their packaging. This is Once in a Blue Mousse. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Okay. So it's in a frosted sort of container. I'm not going to swatch it, but I will be doing a review on all these products probably within two weeks because I want to try out the nail polishes. Oh, I can't try them on. I have to paint my nails this next time when I get them done because I got acrylics. But this is the color, I'm sorry. Oh, it's like this beautiful pastel blue. I don't have anything like this or the other one. Ooh, I'm so excited. Okay, I think... Where did that card go? I got a card from them. Them. Where am I at? Oh, there it is. Sorry. Okay, so this is the card. I hope it says the price. It does not. Okay. Well, I think the cheapest thing was the nail polishes think don't quote me I will link the website down below though I'm pretty sure they were eight dollars somewhere around there no more than 13 no less than six so that's once in a blue mousse and this is peaches and cream I have nothing like this so I decided why not get it with lime crime makeup it's makeup that you normally don't see so just keep that in mind with everything that I'm showing you even though they have way crazier lipsticks than this, they have black, they have white, they have blue. It's crazy. Okay. I would highly recommend you go on their site if you're trying to get out of your comfort zone. That's what I did. So this is Peaches and Cream. Ooh, this is so beautiful. I wish, it's looking a little white on camera, but I wish I had this, these two shades during spring. Perfect spring and summer shades. Okay. I'll show the eyeliners next. Um, I got two of their eyeliners. A little bit smaller than I thought they would be, but I don't really care. Okay, this is, uh, Orchidaceous, I think. Oh, God, I'm really bad with words. I can't get it open. Okay. Oh, I really hope this, like, is totally true to color. It matches my lipstick. So, this is, again, it's an Orchidaceous or something like that. Oh, it has a little fuzz on it. Interesting. Oh, no. All right, I got it off. Oh, I'm excited. <gasps> oh my God, guys, did you see that? Oh God, this is awesome. It has a pink undertone to it, so it's not like completely purple, which I'm kind of in love with. Oh my gosh, do you, do you see this? By the way, my nails are not black. They're showing up black on camera. They're just a really dark purple. Okay. Next one, I got two of those eyeliners. I got lazuli or something like that here I'll show you it's the blue they have two types of blue they have a milky blue and then they have this one it's more like a true blue I think the other ones might call might be called milky blue or something here is that do you see the packaging oh it's gorgeous okay sorry about that that was my brother oh, oh this is absolutely amazing guys <gasps> okay I'm excited I'm excited all right Next one, or next, the last two things are lipsticks. 
So the first one, first of all, this is limited edition packaging. I don't know how they come after this goes away, but this is their sixth anniversary. This is in the shade Jaredima. Oh gosh, I don't know. Can you see it? There we go. I'll mention all the names down below that are kind of hard to say. I kind of messed up the box, by the way. That's from me, not them. Okay. So first of all, the inside is purple. How can you not love that if you're like a total purple fan? And if again, if you're a total purple fan, you're going to love the packaging of these lipsticks. And if you love unicorns, oh god, there's a guy walking by. If you love unicorns, you're also going to love the packaging of this. Let me make sure that's lined up. Okay. That is the packaging. It's a purple bullet. It's. I didn't think it was going to be this fat. I honestly thought it was going to be like um, MAC lipsticks, but it is a little bit fatter than a MAC one. But it's purple. It's. I thought it was holographic, but I guess not. It just says Lime Crime. So the name is Jaredima or something like that. This is. They probably only have like five natural shades. This is like one of their natural shades. So let's watch this. I haven't tried on this one. They're so creamy. Like, I thought this was going to be really, like, hard to put on the purple one. But it was super creamy. It's a beautiful shade. It's like a, like a pinky coral, but more to the pink side. I'm excited, guys. Okay. Then the one I'm wearing is Airborne Unicorn. Oh, I love this. I thought I was going to be like, eh, it does make your teeth a little bit yellow, so keep that in mind. But... I thought I wasn't going to love this as much as I do. I thought it was going to be like a once in a while sort of thing. And by the way, I have no other makeup on. I just was doing schoolwork and then the package came and I was like, I cannot wait. So, yeah. So this is Airborne Unicorn. Ooh, I, I love it. I love it. This is really going to be a favorite of mine in fall time. Oh, this one's so creamy. And they smell like, like vanilla. <laughs> yeah, I guess like vanilla. You can see the eyeliner's, um, what's it called? Again, dried matte, so there's no shimmer to it or anything. These two colors go really good together. Oh, I'm obsessed with this one. Obsessed with the packaging as well. So, show you the other stuff I bought online. Ooh, almost came through the box. I seriously was, I ordered this three weeks ago. And then when it was like two weeks, I emailed them and they said that it had delivered, but I obviously never got it. And they said they would send me a new one and it came within like a week, almost a little under a week. Okay, next thing is from Sephora. I only ordered off of Sephora because of the, I doubt they have this anymore, but the 500 point perk sort of deal. Um, so yeah, this is orange and stuff. And I've been wanting to try Orangin's skincare for a while because it's really good supposedly for dry skin people. And it's just really good in general. So, kind of crowded up here. It has four things in it. It comes with, okay. I'm just going to keep this right here. It comes with an eye cream. This is the Ginseng Refreshing Eye Cream to Brighten and Deep Puff. I'm pretty sure this has coffee in it. Um... Review the color. I've tried this a couple times now, but I can't really give like a straight on review. Now it does have a more pink tone than it's showing up on camera. I personally really enjoy this so far, at least. I do think that it does um, deep puff. I haven't noticed any brightening yet. Okay. Then I have the energy boosting moisturizer. So this is the daily moisturizer. Okay. That didn't happen. Sorry, I'm all over the place. I'm just really excited from the Lime Grime stuff. This is more of a gel type of lotion or moisturizer. Thought. Okay. And then it came with a night cream, which is the High Potency Night Amins. And this is more, it's a lot thicker. I've only tried this once, but I, I liked it so far. It's very, very thick, though. So it's definitely something that a little will go a very long way. Where my eye just... Okay, last thing in here is the Origins Checks and Balances Frothy Face Wash, which I haven't tried this yet, but interested in that. If you didn't know how to get like these types of things, 
This costs 500 points, which is if you have a Sephora card and you spend a certain amount, like they have 100 point perks, and I think it only it goes from 100 to 500 or 100 to 3. I don't know, but um, yeah, it's just how every dollar you spend is. I saved up the 500 points, which is 500 dollars. That's a lot, but I saved. I didn't get it all at once. I saved probably since the beginning of this year and maybe even a little bit before last year because I wanted to get something big like this. Okay, so obviously you have to order in order to get your thing. So I ordered the Smashbox Full Exposure Travel Palette. This is not the full size one. I wanted to try the full size one, but I was kind of skeptical because there were some shades that was like, I'm never going to use you. So when I seen this, I was like, I would totally use almost every shade. I probably won't use this shade. I'm not big on silver colors but so far I'm liking this palette I've only tried one look with it which is just I've only tried this on the lid this on the crease and I think this one on the crease too and this on the brow bone so far I'm liking it it's only $22 so so far it's okay I wouldn't say I recommend it yet because I need to try it some more but it is pretty nice okay then the last thing is some lashes I'm pretty sure I got these, yeah, maybe not, um, I was, thought I got them from Eyelashes Unlimited or something, but I got one, two, three, four, five, six, six pairs, all by Red Cherry, um, this one did not know it was going to look like this or else I would not have gotten it, but I've been practicing with these just because I'm not, I would never wear these out or anything, so I'm practicing with these to see if I can apply my good ones, um, this is the number 68. But some of you guys might like them. I, I don't. And I'm not someone who wears lashes every... Like, I rarely wear lashes. Just for mostly videos. I want to look a little bit more glammed or something. Now, I thought these were for the top lashes, but they're actual, actually bottom lashes. So, I probably would never use them. Maybe for Halloween. If there's any occasion or any look that I'm doing. This is number 33's. I'm cherry again. And these are only $2.50 on Eyelashes Unlimited. Number 502s, which again are bottom lashes. Three more. I got two of the 747 Extra Smalls, which these are kind of like Demi Wispies from Ardell. You can see I've worn this one. I like these. They're, pretty, they're not super natural, but they are a little bit natural. And then I got number 747U, which I don't think... I would say these are a little bit longer, the 747Us, and more um curved so I would say these are more natural than these I also got the Ardell brush on lash adhesive because I had the brush tip I like my duo actually a lot better than this but I liked this because it had the brush tip it's okay it's not like the best lash glue I've ever well, I've only tried duo on this one so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video I wanted to put in makeup geek but I haven't ordered from them yet so Maybe that'll be another haul. I know I do a lot of hauls. I tried to keep it down. I don't think I posted one in like a week or two. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this online purchasing sort of stuff. If you guys want to purchase from Lime Crime, it's just LimeCrime.com. I'll have it down below and I'll put everything that I ordered in the description box so you know the color names because I didn't know how to say them much. It is making me look a little pale in the camera, but that's because I'm like, what's it called? No, it's making me more white. Um, the sun's like right in front of me, so it's kind of making me look a little bit too white. Anyways, I'm obsessed. I love this. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will see you guys in my next one, and thank you for watching. Bye.